I was intently watching it because I felt like something was going to happen. I almost dropped it. That was funny. Nice. Is Hi. that hers or yours? It's mine. Oh. It just has Those are stickers on it. So her friend's sh- like business. Oh. Quote, unquote. She started like a sticker company on, what is it? Etsy. Etsy. And I bought them for nice. support. They were cute. Yeah. And they're TikTok things. Yeah, that's like a song. Shawty oh. got the fatty. Oh. Shawty, my little baddie. She, my little boo thing. Mm. And she got the fatty. And then Annie and got me the Stranger baddie. Things one. A couple of them. Out of my. Advent oh, calendar. yeah. You want to talk about that? I I'm did talk about it last week. Okay. A little well, bit. I didn't. So, so Andy let's made get me an update for me and everyone. Andy made me an advent calendar. It says 24 Days of Joseph. 24 days of Joseph. And I'm halfway through. What does this say? It's like a little love note. Little, little no- oh, it's taped up. It's private. Okay. Gotcha. What I don't does this say? Those are the rules. Number order only one gift per day. Have you been following those rules yep. so far? Don't skip days. Did, Did you skip not, a day? Nope. Match the sticker to your gift of the day. What sticker? There's So when I pull one of these um, cups out. There's a sticker in there's it. There's a piece of... Notebook paper. Ah, post-it Just note. Just like that. No, but notebook paper. It's okay. notebook paper. Oh, okay. And there's a Hot Wheels or car-related sticker slapped ah. onto it. And the matching sticker is on the present. Inside my closet. Perfect. I like that. So I open one every day. So keep reading the rules. Okay, so if I am not here to reward... To record. Record, please record yourself. So I've been vlogging every day opening a gift. Did you notice my new... Oh, no, you didn't because the... Blankets covering. Pull the blanket back. There, I got new bed sheets from her. Oh, ah, well, are guess. they navy blue? Yes. I like it. And they're t-shirt material, so they're super soft. Ooh. They're very cool. That's cool. What is um, HBD or whatever? Happy birthday or whatever. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Or whatever is a little inside joke. Okay, gotcha. Or whatever. Because it used to be you're cute or whatever. Or whatever. <laughs> I was like, "What?" All right. So, what'd you get on day one? I got mini M and M's. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you remember you showed. What'd you get on day two? I'm gonna test him. What'd you get on day two? Did you remember what he got on day two? I have a list. But do you remember up here? Okay, so see, it's not that bad if she can't remember all of them up in her head. It's not yeah. that bad. Oh, wait, yeah, you. oh. What'd you get, Justin, on day two? Um, uh, it's been two, two almost two weeks. It's been a week and a half since that day, so I, mean, I understand why you wouldn't remember. But was it the Reese's pretzels? No, that was Thursday, right? It was a Thursday that you gave it to me. I don't remember. What do you get on day two, Andy? Oh, uh, the League of Legends! Wow, the ten dollars League of Legends card. Heck yeah! And then number three was that the pretzels? Oh my goodness! Uh uh-uh. uh, that was one of the first ones. Yeah, because I finished it off really fast. Pretzels was five days ago. Oof. Um, that's number eight. If you track. So what? You broke it. You broke a present? Uh, yes, the phone cable. A phone charger. Oh. It was sitting on my desk, and I guess my phone fell, and it snapped the plug-in part off in my charger, so I had to go out and like pull it oh, out. Oh, bummer. Yeah, sucks. It was, was an accident. What was number four? That'd be a good one, your favorite number four. It was four. my favorite number. <laughs> so Something good. She said something good for your favorite number, and I stapled it to it. Was it four of something? No. Oh. Wow, man. Come on, man. I don't like this. Because today I was saying, I can't fucking keep track of how many things I've gotten. This is crazy. Like. Yeah. That's why I've also been recording. Yeah. So I can know. Did you save them? Yeah. Well, there you go. Yeah. Well, you can remember that way. Yeah. What do you get for number four, Andy? 
Oh, condoms. Bet. Yeah. Something special for number four. Yeah. What was number five? That was so I got the Oreos. I got the or it was a heart shaped Oreo box. Oh, nice! And a bunch of mini two packs of Oreos in it. Heck yeah! Have you tried the mega stuffed Oreo that they sell? Yeah, it's kind of gross. I bet too much cream. Mm -hmm. What about number six? That was the Monday. Was that the pretzels? No, No, pretzels was eight. I already reminded you what day that would be. Pretzels was eight. So that was Wednesday. Eight would have been a Wednesday. Eight? Eight? And that was a Wednesday? Oh my goodness gracious. What does the day matter? What does the day matter? Because I'm relating it to what I did that day. Oh. And seeing if you can remember that day. Was Monday bed sheets? Yeah, Monday was bed sheets. Most recent Monday? No, five or whatever. That six. No, six. six. Six was bed sheets. Seven. This is a Tuesday, so it would have been. Would have been. No, that would have been pretzels, <laughs> and then tomorrow. Oh, no. The seven, seven is when. Seven is pretzels, and eight is Red Bulls. Yeah. Mm, okay. Yeah, she got it mixed up. Good job. You did it. What was number nine? I mean, after Red Bulls. That was the day after work. A lot, I'm sure a lot of them were a day after work. No, because I didn't work Monday, Tuesday, oh, or Wednesday. Oh, that's right. That's right. Thursday right, was the right, first right, day right, right, right. back from work, and I was super excited to open it. It was the picture frame, right? Picture a, frame. She got me the picture that oh, Kwa nice. took of me and her with my in car. the car. Nice. Yep. What's it that under it? It it's the sticker? the sticker. It's okay. the note with the sticker on All it. Right. What was number 10? 10. 10. It was two days ago. That was Friday. You helped me record that one. No, she didn't. Yes. Oh, no, you didn't because I did it when I got home at 3.30 in the fucking morning. Friday? Yeah, from Hannah's. So you did it way late? Yeah, I technically did it Saturday morning. Uh. I technically missed a day. It was a, our favorite, right? So it was the chips. the chips. No, that was what I did yesterday with you. I did. So the before the chips, frame. after the frame. After the what? Frame. Oh, picture. Picture, sorry. <sighs> I just talked. Oh, the stickers. That's right. My Stranger oh, Things stickers. Oh, the stickers. And number 12 today. She helped film it. It was today. Yeah, she helped film it. What was it? Joseph. <laughs> it was today. <laughs> Dude, we had a Dude, crazy I've time at Chili's. Dude, i so much weed today. We've had a crazy night at Chili's. We had a crazy night. Is that the, for later? Huh? Oh, that's right. Yeah. That's why. Did you use the disposable camera at Chili's? No. Oh. I blanked. <laughs> Chili's was so bad tonight, dude. Really? It was horrible. The service was dog shit. That sucks. Yeah, it was real I bad. I like Chili's. We usually do, too. That's a bummer. Don't go to this one anymore. Don't go to this one. Okay, fair enough. I mean, I, I usually just order takeout chili, so I don't usually go in. Yeah, Subway in 360 is where it's at. All right, fair enough. What was so bad about it? The service. Like, we had three different servers. What the fuck? And was it that busy? Or? No. It was that, like, they didn't know what the fuck was going on. And our food wasn't completely right. If it wasn't right. busy, then why the fuck don't you know what's going yeah, on? Yeah, we had a manager take our order, and then the server walked up and was like, Are did somebody take order? y'all's order already? We were like, yeah, the, I'm pretty sure your manager just did. And he's like, okay. And then... The manager um, never put in the order. No, he puts in the oh, order, okay. so he comes out, um, he hands us the food... He, and uh, we get like halfway through. We're both done with our drinks. And I need a refill. And he's asking if we're ready for dessert. And I was like, yeah, I need a refill. Um, he's like, okay. And then he saw she needed a refill. Mm-hmm. So he walks back into the back. He comes. She He doesn't come out. Some random girl comes out that we hadn't even seen yet. Walks out with two drinks. Gives them to us. 
And then another guy walks up and goes, did y'all need re... Oh, never mind. Like, he was supposed to refill and didn't realize it. And then we sat there forever. We finally got to the dessert. No silverware to use for the dessert. Nice. So we had to wait and ask for forks for this, the dessert. They came back, and they forgot my to-go box. And so when we were leaving again, she was like, can he get a to-go box? And he's like, oh, yeah, I'm sorry. He goes and gets his to-go box. and then gets Trash. It yeah, Awful. so they got a $1 tip. Good. I'm not. Split said, that four ways, penny? assholes. I said, can I leave that a penny? And she goes, no, that's rude. You no, can't split okay. a penny, so. Yeah. They each got a... Good for them. Yeah. This is ridiculous. Ridiculous. The food was okay. Yeah. It wasn't like the best chilies we've ever had. We need to try Wing Bucket soon. I'm down. We need to go to Wing Bucket. It's excellent. I'm game. It's so good. Sounds good. Yeah. Their normal wet wings are like extra, extra wet. Like how Buffalo Wild Wings do extra, extra wet. And they come extra, extra wet. Hell yeah. And they do the boneless nugget Nuggets. style. But dude, Buffalo Wild Wings boneless are like this. Wing buckets boneless are like this. Holy fuck. I'm not even They're kidding. They're like whole breasts. They're Jesus. like two to three normal nuggets. Like chicken Damn, nuggets. what the hell? They're like quarter pieces of Where breast. Where is it? In the Highlands? In the said? Highlands. And it's three ninety nine for a four piece of the boneless. Tomorrow night? So it's a dollar a piece. Tomorrow night? I'm down. <laughs> Tomorrow night? Well, let's, well, let's go. go. It's I'm good. Down. Ethan, you want to go get some wings? They're fries. You can do like how Buffalo Wild Wings does, get, get a claw. seasoning on their fries. Let's get quad to go too. Yeah. It's so good. The sour cream and onion fries, dude. So good. That sounds bomb. That so sounds put really that on a cracker, good. dude. Put that on a cracker, <laughs> dude. I eat that with anything, dude. That with love anything, that dude. guy. I love his crawfish boil videos. Oh, yeah. About to boil me some crawfish. It's a fucking Ford Ranger. I like that guy, too. I ain't no that truck. I ain't no stranger. It's a Ford fucking Ranger. <laughs> I can't believe you remembered all that. Yes, sir. I love TikTok. Uh, Mitchell messaged me today, and she goes, Trevor, I just got to say I love you because you're the only one that sends me TikToks. And I was like, honestly, 30% of the TikToks I send you, talking to her, are ones that my brother sent me. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh. That one you sent me today was really good. Which with one? The goose attacking the goose. <laughs> Yeah, God, TikTok's so good. I'm sad I missed Vine just because of TikTok. One time, me and her, we like just weren't <coughs> sending TikToks as often anymore. And she goes, "Why don't you send me TikToks Aww. anymore?" I was like, "Oh, I'm sorry." That's like a thing now. You yeah. have to send TikToks oh, if, if they send you. It's almost a requirement. Mm -hmm. But it's so much fun. TikTok is so it's so good. good. It's There's so much good quality content <sighs> on there. How is it free? How is it free? <laughs> That's what. I I mean the ads in the beginning, yeah. But still, like yeah, you regardless. can skip it after five seconds. Like what the fuck? Regardless, yeah. Love TikTok. You can skip one ad and then watch TikTok for four Put hours straight. Crack a dude. Put that on a crack a dude. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Put that on a crack a dude. About a ball, make some grove. <laughs> Is TikTok like? Can you play TikTok on? Shit? Put your potatoes. No, you can't. You really? can't get DMCA'd for certain like the sounds. Behind the TikToks, that's the issue. Oh, true. I bet if you played his videos, you wouldn't because oh, yeah, be there's no good. like music. Um, about to teach you how to make a roux. Put that on a cracker, dude. Did you see that? He dude. eats roux with a cracker. That's it. That's. Oh. I mean, just it's just makes... butter and oil. Yeah. So. Oh, it's butter and oil. What was you can I use butter. Earlier? You can. I said flour. Oh. Well, it's flour. It's butter. Or I said oil flour and, oil. and flour. Yeah, you can use oil or butter. Asleep. This goddamn mother. This motherfucker. Mother <laughs> There's one I wanted to show you, but I forgot what it was. I might not have liked it. Put that on a crack, dude. All right, dude. We got to talk about the snow days. We, we snow can't days. Be sitting on we TikTok. have snow days. We can't be sitting on TikTok. It's Sorry. Not. It's TikTok. I know. That's There's hard. time for his TikToks and Once podcasts. I open it, I'm sucked Podcasts in. aren't time for TikToks. Mm -hmm. Had to talk about TikTok. We've just had a podcast them. where we watch TikTok <laughs> <just, yeah. laughs> and play them uh, in the video section. It'd have to be like a private one. Yeah, that that's like fine. Would be like behind a wall that like people wouldn't like report it, like copyright shit. We can just put it on YouTube and make no AdSense or whatever the fuck. 
They like, can like you can mute forfeit. it. They can mute the certain parts. Even of, if you forfeit all rights, yeah. I don't think they can do that. Mm-hmm. If you put in the description, I forfeit all rights. Blah 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 blah. Plenty of people do that. They'll mute it still mm. if it's certain sounds. That's fucked up. Yeah. <sighs> YouTube's mean now. So snow days. Snow days, man. Texas. What the fuck? That was nuts. What the fuck? After the second, I was like, "All right, I'm over it." It was fun. It was a great novelty. No, I loved it. I loved every day of it. Man. Every it single was, day of it. Okay, the cloudy, like dreary days, I wasn't having it. But like the nice sunny days, where it was still like not what the throat nice. goblin, the throat sunny goblin days. that snuck out. Sorry, <laughs> the nice sorry days. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's funny is they can't hear the throat gobble. Yeah. <laughs> um, what was I saying? Like the nice sunny days when it was just like almost blinding to look at the yes, snow. Yeah, Tuesday. Yeah. It was uh, like Tuesday yeah. in the middle mm-hmm. of the day. It hurt mm-hmm. to go it outside to without sunglasses. It yeah. was so cool. There was snow like there was there was snow everywhere. Like, it was weird. Like Texans aren't used to not being able to see the concrete that they walk on. <laughs> Or drive on. Or drive on. Yeah. I was I was talking about it to my coworkers the other day. I was like, I got used to driving twenty to thirty every day. And now I'm so once slow. the roads open, I'm like, holy shit, going the speed limit feels fast. Right. Right. I was, I told it you the feels other day. So fast. I went to Jack in the Box. Uh, what was the day? Was that Friday? Yeah. Friday for lunch. Uh, um, the Jack in the Box by uh Cooper and Sublet. Yeah. Was around oh, and yeah. out in cooper street mm-hmm. and the way they had it is you had to go into the parking lot and up that big hill yeah to go out onto cooper to get in the line. and it was all ice scion couldn't make it up it oh nice. so i got stuck halfway <laughs> yep. going backwards yeah and so i finally had to like get the guy behind me to move so i could go down sublet get back out i went all the way down sublet to the 287 in sublet oh my god and sat in that line because it was long but it wasn't super hard to get into yeah. so i sat in that line for like 15 20 minutes what was it i think it was tuesday but yeah no i drove on 287 Ugh. back from that jack in the box and it was like oh my fucking god i was on the phone with her i was like this car is not used to going 70 right now really? this is crazy right? fast well in that shit yeah well on the highway I'm yeah sure it was, it was fine better. yeah it was but fine on normal but... roads going the speed limit oh it's still sketch it was so sketch but fun it was intersections are bad bad very bad very thursday bad. night leaving work i had to leave at six uh-huh. when we were closing and it was getting dark and me and mike are driving down the road and we're hitting he all these yes you can eat the fucking thing <laughs> jesus <laughs> i heard the crackling and i was like what the fuck is that sound um we were driving down cooper and we were just driving, and it, we were normal because the roads were pretty melted that day. Yeah. And we get down to the first light, and it's red, and he goes, does your car feel funny? And I was like, yeah. And he goes, I'm pretty sure we just drove on all ice back there. Mm-hmm. Every little line that was in the road that we thought was just water was already turning into ice yeah. again. We were like, oh, fuck. So we it's started driving real cool. slow. Yeah. <laughs> this is scary. I was leaving a Tiff's neighborhood um, like as the sun was rising, and this was, I think, Thursday. So most of the road snow was gone and it had not snowed anymore. And I went to go turn onto another street and I just kept going straight. Oh, and I was like, shit. oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I guess I'm going to the next street. <laughs> and I just straight back. I was like, okay, I'm just going to keep going. <laughs> that was me coming home from her house. Um, Valentine's night. Yeah. I left her house at like 540 and it had just started snowing really bad. Mm. And so it was coming down and the well, roads snow's were good. pretty snows ba- will give you The roads were pretty bad already. Ice. Yeah. The roads were still pretty bad already. They had been covered from the day of snowing in and general. And melting and compacting and Yeah, turning and everybody snow. driving on it. So yeah. I'm coming home. I dumbass me doesn't go the long way up all the way up Debbie and then go up the hill behind the house that's gradual. I come down here and, you try and, and I come this down hill. this big hill and I'm hitting the brakes and oh, I'm you're going to down. I'm just, oh, I'm turning on this little hill to go up the big hill. Yes. So I'm like coming down that hill and I'm hitting the brakes and it's not slowing Stopping down that. to make that turn. And I was like, oh fuck, I guess I'm just gonna go up the next <laughs> hill. I start going up the next hill and got fucking stuck. Imagine if I tried going up ours. 
I would oh, not, have made, not have made it. It took me 15 close. minutes on that hill alone going Just trying to make it. That's the problem with like people for manuals. I don't have, we good have to tires. give it a good little rev to start going. I don't have good tires well, on that side. Yeah. That's bad. I need all weather. People don't understand that if you just in automatic cars, if you just ease into Lightly, it, it'll roll it'll itself go, and you're yeah. fine. You I'm won't like, slide. People are like, and they're like, oh shit, and then they stop. And it's like, don't learn how to the fucking drive. I'm are you sorry. laughing because it's you? <laughs> I'm sorry, but not knowing how to drive is one of my biggest pet peeves. Oh yes, me too. Biggest, I have the worst road rage, and that's the only time you'll see me truly angry is on the road. And people I hate do not bad driving. It yeah. irritates the fuck because it is one of the hard. easiest things to do. <laughs> it's not that hard. It's not hard it's at not all. Hard. <laughs> yeah. God. It's not that hard. I Let's was, get off angry. <laughs> I was driving around the neighborhood in the Scion because uh-huh. Ethan bought me a battery Monday for my birthday for the 240 to yeah. try and get it working. Wait, where? At the O'Reilly's at fucking Sublet and Cooper. Why did you buy it? You could have got it half price <laughs> with my account. Because I didn't want to go all the way there, so we went How to the super for, close 150? one. I don't know what he paid. What did you get? The two year or the three. three? I got the three. I got the. You max. paid a hundred and seventy something dollars. He paid it. I insi- I told him no. I told him you several paid times. $80 I told him word. several times no, and so he was like, "No, let's go to the close one and see if they have Y'all it." Are dumb. They didn't have power, and he goes, "The other one at Cooper and Tublet has it." And I was like, "Ethan, let's just go home." That okay? And so you could have been like, "Hey, I Trevor, just said, I'm you're okay. at work. Get me a battery." I said, for "I'm half okay." The cost. I said, "I don't need it. I'm okay. Like I don't need it. I'm fine. Just leave it." And so he goes and gets me the battery. I try starting it, and it draws too much power and breaks the main fuse. So now it doesn't have any power at all. Yeah, so I have to go buy a new main. It was fuse too again. good of a battery. No, it the cold motor was so cold it was cranking so hard oh. it drew so much power out of the new battery it was melting the wire so it blew the fuse. Oh my fuck! That's what fuses do. Well, I know that, but yeah, when a wire gets too hot and has too much resistance through it, it blows the fuse. Well, it the blew battery off. probably wasn't cold enough. No, the. The whole car wasn't warm enough. It had been Whoa. sitting for too long without ever Wait, running. Wait, the 240? Was, yes. Oh, I thought we were talking about the sign. No. Sorry. No, the 240. No, you don't need to drive that thing in the snow. I insisted. I was like, I'll go around the neighborhood, but I don't need to like go out and do what Logan and Hannah were doing. They were in the parking lots and shit. But I was like, I can't get the 240 out. Yeah. Especially with your slick. clutch, you shouldn't be trying yeah. to. Duh. It wasn't me. I said no. Ethan, I'm sorry. You're a very smart guy, but that is... I said no. That's bad. That is a no-no. I said no. You messed up and, on that one, And the one, fuse buddy. popping was a Multiple sign. ways. Not the even just like the battery. Not even just convincing to go. That was multiple... No, no-nos. you should have seen him convincing me to go. It took him about 35 minutes. <laughs> I was insisting so much. No. <laughs> I was like, Ethan, I'm not going. He was like, I'm going to go by myself and bring it back. I was like, no, you're not. <laughs> He's like, yes, I am. Let's go. I was like, oh, my goodness. Okay. Jeez. Um, we did it. Oh, while we're on the 240, thank you to, for today, today when yeah. I called you. This dude had a 97 Nissan pickup. And the fucking whatever, whenever you look up a 97 Nissan pickup, it still pulls up the KA 2.4. Yeah, it's okay. But it brings up just the, the, the regular rim, valve cover seal. Yeah. And I was like, the what the fuck? T- Why can't I fucking find tubes. this? So I just Googled 2.4 Nissan engine valve cover gasket and it gave me the Felpro part right away. And I was like, what That's what I said. You should, I, was, I was right there behind you. I was on Njuku looking up the Felpro part number four. Really? Yeah. 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 It was dumb. That's why I was like, go to Njuku, go to Njuku. And I was literally typing it in, but we yeah. were in a league match. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. We were playing Earth. Oh. So it, it didn't yeah. matter, but. That's why I was like. This is a this is a KA. I know exactly who to call. <laughs> that was amazing. When I have like other things like old Chevys or something like a 350 or 305 or something, I have a guy to call. But I'm like Nissan engine KA done. <laughs> I know who to call. <laughs> I know exactly who to call. <laughs> I heard you say I'm on the phone with my ex. Right, I was like. That feels good. Yep. Mm-hmm. That feels mm-hmm. good. Right. KA expert. Yeah. I like that. That's cable K-A expert. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> the cable K-A expert. Oh, speaking Jesus. of cables, guess who I saw at work today? Who did you see at work Chris. today? Chris Cable. Mike's oh, son. Mike's son. Nice. Yeah. What was he doing? He saw he saw me, and he walked up to me, and I didn't recognize him. Mask, of course. 
He's like, what's up, Trevor? And I was like, hey, what's up? How does this guy know my name as I'm processing this? And I was like, oh, fuck, it's Chris. Hey, what's up, man? He said he used to work there. I had no idea. Yeah. Uh, no idea. He used to work on the night crew or something. Man, I was so tempted to give him my discount, but like the way it works, we're not supposed to ring up things on our discount on our like, you know, computer like, on ourself. Like oh, we can't somebody reuse our is. discount. Somebody else is supposed thing. to ring out your discount. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. You're right, Ethan. He said, oh, he's recovering from something. He's understanding what you're saying. Oh. <laughs> I think that vitamin C trick worked. Vitamin C? If you drink an emergency before you puff, puff, pass. The bars. You get. You then sh- well, so does the. It's not necessarily. Essentially. It's mango. Well, yeah, vitamin C. Mango's a good source. Mang- oh, okay. Did y'all drink emergency before? He you? did. Oh. I told him about it, and he took a, a vitamin C tablet that he takes. Oh. He took two of them every. He takes one every day, but he took two of them today to test. Uh, is it working, Ethan? I would say so. He'd say yes. I would say He's yes. He's saying yes. So, <laughs> time check. Can I look at my watch? No. Damn it. Cheer. I didn't even see it. I can't <laughs> read a watch like that fast. Um, three, two. Whoa! Ding, 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 ding. Ring, ding, dinger. Exactly? 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 Yes, Gwen's child. Exactly. exactly. What if he named his son exact, exact instead of Zachly? <gasps> Good save. I'd be like me wanting to name my son Ty. Yeah. Middle mm. name. No, mm. middle name. Just Warner. Warner. No, not Warner. You got to name it Warner. I Ty can't Warner Cable. do it because it's just Ty Warner Cable. I no, can't then it doesn't it. sound good. Yes, it sounds it does. stupid. No, it doesn't. Ty Warner? Ty Warner Cable. It sounds like you forgot letters. What are they talking about? I don't know. He's over there whispering. Oh, shit. And she's covering her mouth, so I can't see what she's saying. Yeah, she always covers her face. <laughs> She said shit. She's These motherfuckers. Talking. Y'all realize we're recording a podcast here. You don't need to be having side conversations. Secrets. What? Motherfuckers. I'm not used to a live audience of yeah, more than one. This is weird. It's weird. It's weird because you're back. This is, this is weird? It's been almost two weeks I feel now. like it'd be normal and last week was weird. No, last week was not weird for me. Speaking of which, kind of episode 69 and a half. Oh my God, it's 70. And this is can we get a vote? Can we get a poll vote in our some kind of Facebook group of the listeners and have it named 69 and a half? Because I'm sorry. It wasn't an episode of what do you call it? I'm sorry for not being here. It's your fault. It is my fault. You but at the same time, here. one, the that night was the worst night to be driving of all the snow days. For sure. And two, it was Valentine's Day. Monday night? Sunday night. We recorded it on Monday. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Still. Because I said we needed to do it at least Monday morning. Which I worked. No, I didn't. Yeah. I was off Monday. Yeah. It was a great day. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. I had a great Monday off. I bet you did. Yep, I sure did. Motherfucker. You're welcome. Just took a week off from the podcast. You know what? I don't feel bad. Okay, good for you. Good for you. I think it's okay that we take a break sometimes. We don't have to have them every single day on a certain time. (coughs) We have five listeners. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It does matter. It doesn't matter. I think our listeners will understand. Having some sort of schedule is nice. It is nice. Some sort of schedule, not an exact perfect schedule. Okay, so then why can't we like? I feel why can't we double up when we we? Because you know how many hours we sit here. I feel bad. I shouldn't feel bad for like making you wait to record a podcast. You didn't make me wait. It was our decision to just wait till Monday. All we all three agreed that Monday would have been better, and then you said, "I don't really. I'm not comfortable driving." I said, "Okay." I was willing to do it by myself. But you shouldn't have to feel like you need to do it by yourself. I didn't feel like I needed to do it by myself. I like my drive to make sure I want to do it every Monday. That's my personal it's a nice preference. Goal. Yes, so that's what I but wanted to do. So I did it. It doesn't matter if it's, it's 15 okay to be a little hour. lenient on your goals. Mm, <gasps> no, because this then is not, not a major goal of life to film a it's, podcast no, every week. No, but it's still a goal that 
is if I'm consistent with it now, that's going to help me be consistent with other things in life later. Because if no. I slack here, then I'm going to start slacking because no. I think it's okay to because slack. Because you in can other regulate the importance life. of hey, time out. What's happening? Is that a time? You went like this, but I think time out's this. Can you hear me? Yes. yes. So, what matters more to you? Your schedule or doing it with Trevor? I think my personal thing is making sure that I have one every week ready for me and you to have out. That's what I was getting to is because I wanted to have one. Why can't we like pre-record one? Randomly, but is it that's an fine. Episode of but what do you, is it an episode of what do you call yes, it? Yes, as I said, like we would sit here and like double up on an episode because we have time one day, and then we that's have fine. a spare one for if we miss a week, we can just have so something to put out. So we learn from this. Yes, I know. I'm not. I'm not mad at you, and you shouldn't feel bad for not being here. I felt like not that you. Did you hear that? I think it was Ethan standing oh. up. Uh, I felt like you. I don't know how to put this into words. Like, <laughs> how how do I say this? Your sweatshirt's on inside out. No, it's not. Why does it look like that? It says broke bitch on it. Are those actual danglies? No, they're chains. They're like fake chains on the... It looks like the inside of like a patch or something. That's why I was like, what the fuck? No. I'm sorry, I got distracted. Where'd you get that? It's TMG merch. I've never seen you wear that. Yeah. I've had it for like a year now. What? Yeah. Has he? No. I wear this I've seen you wear a yellow hoodie, but never. I wear this one in the Tiny Meat Gang one. They're both I see the TMG the one all the time. Well, this is still. Well, about the one that says yes, Tiny, Tiny Meat Gang. Yes, Tiny Meat Gang, yeah. I just don't I've like wearing that one to her house. Because it says bitch. Tiny Meat Gang. No, the other one. I'd much You'd rather, rather wear that one? Yes. I'd much rather one that says broke bitch than compared to tiny meat gang on the sleeves. Fair enough. You and roll up the sleeves tiny and it doesn't meat say anything. Tore on the back. Oh, okay. Yeah I'm, yeah, I'm okay. I'd much rather just walk in and say broke, broke bitch, bitch instead. Fair enough. When it, and honestly, I'm not. It was the 3D effect that threw me off. Yeah, they're supposed to look like chains. Yeah. Because that's what they have in the video. They yeah. have a video in gold chains that say broke bitch. Are they real? I don't think so. No. Maybe. I don't know. Um, Could be sorry. Jobs. That was a... It's a, just a really dis, like weird texture. That's what freaked me out about it. Sorry. And yeah, I've never seen the it shadows before. shadows. Yeah. That's, that's what freaked what me out. threw you off. Yeah. Sorry. Cause Did you light. lose that B? Or is mm-hmm. that... Because that... The B and broke is not there. Or am I tripping? Oh, it is kind of coming off, huh? That's what I was wondering. Yeah, it looks like it's kind of fading off. Yeah, it looks like you lost the gray part of it. Yeah, because it's like missing right here on the top of the yard yeah. as well. Oops. Oh, it must come off in the wash. That's a bummer. The fuck, TMG? Make higher quality shit. That sucks. Um, Through... I just feel like it shouldn't be such a pressure to have an episode every week. I understand it's a good goal to have of just something of a goal, period. That's I think that's why I like it is because it's like, that's like footsteps for me because I never had like basic goals like that. But my outlook on life is different from your outlook on life as well. Like yeah. if you set goals, you can not meet those goals and then be upset if you never set goals you're never upset i don't have any goals in life at this point i'm happy we're just two different people i mean yeah and that's great yeah that's the best part about human life is diversity well one of the best parts yeah fucking is a great one too yeah 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 are we back on our episode 69 69 i've heard that many great we've reviews. heard that 69 was our best episode in a of our long highlights. Time. yeah they said if we need more episode 69s we need more episodes we need to have hannah on for episode 69 part two because <laughs> hannah loves part talking two. about sex so yeah. that'd be great yeah i like it let's do it did you care that i talk about our sex life on 69 hell yeah 
You didn't even get that much detail. I didn't give a ton of detail. Oh, perfect. We have the approval. 69.42, Hannah. <laughs> 69 bar two, Hannah. Hannah, you're coming. Get in there. <laughs> Hannah, you're coming. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, you're going to be here for that episode. Huh? huh? Oh, May 9th. Oh, no, that'd be not May. That'd oh, I'm be June, sorry, June buddy. 9th. On June 9th, we'll record 69 part two. Well, that would be 6 9. Yeah, I'm done. What if that's a Sunday? Damn, Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, all of our birth me, you, and her birthdays are on Fridays this <gasps> year. Yours too? Mm-hmm. Fuck yeah. Is your birthday on a Friday, Ethan? What birth July 10th? July 10th. Yeah, same day as Jalen. I do agree that we should have. It's on a Saturday. Holy oh, shit. Close. Nice. Close enough. I do agree that we should have a few backup episodes just in case. So, like, one weekend where we're, like, both really free. Yeah. and they were Which just not is never for me. I'm never really free on a weekend because of fucking work. But Well, if I come home on a Monday and you've had the day off. Yeah. Instead of playing League for four hours, we, we can, can record, record a two, podcast for an hour. Or just, yeah, just and record then, our backup that Monday. Yeah. yeah and then uh, record an, a real one that next Sunday. Yeah. I'm down for that. We just have a backup or we just, two. We just record, welcome to, what do you call it, episode... And then insert the audio insert clip. The, episode it was a, a, 72. <laughs> just have like a text to speech. Yep, exactly. 72. All the topics we talk about are not up to date. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that'd be hilarious. That'd be a good one, yeah. We should definitely do that now. For what sure. if what if we got ahead? What if we like did two next weekend and then yeah. we like every weekend was... Next Sunday I'm off, so it won't be a problem. Uh, well, then we're also on that thing that it's not current. Because if you record a week ahead you know, every week, that. I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Like I feel we like can that's just record a generic me. episode. Yeah, that yeah. that's like a, just a backup episode. Yeah, a filler. Yeah, we love anime filler. We love it. Hate it actually. <sighs> we need to get Hannah on the get anime back to the game. action. I've tried. I've tried getting her into it. You won't get an anime? We tried watching Your Lie in April. I forgot it was as long as it was. So it's kind of hard. Okay, so TV-wise, what's your genre that you enjoy most? Cartoons. She's a cartoon. Which I know. That's... I know. I know. I think I need to get her to watch. What kind of cartoons? My attention span is not up for like anything longer than 20 minutes. So you can watch an episode at a time. Does does TV just not okay. draw your interest? Okay, well that's a problem because anime is for people who it draws interest and you like want to see the next episode. If it's not for you, it's not for you. That's fine. I was trying to get her to the end of your line April to like wrap that up, that whole show up because that's yeah. a damn good show. I've never seen it, man. Man, it's for the music people. Music the, people. The music. The people that like music. Oh really? Yeah. Oh. It's kind of like like music theory like. Violins and pianos, like classic music kind of Violence stuff. Violins and pianos? Violins. Oh, violins. <clears throat> and pianos. Like classic pianos. Yeah. Gotcha. It's really good. You need to watch Elf and Lie. Elf and Lie. Qual will tell you to watch, watch Elf and Lie. Okay. Have you seen Elf and Lie, Ethan? He shakes his head no. Um, you should both watch Elf and Lie really high. You'd be like, what the... I mean, you really... Cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be like, what the fuck is happening right now? Um, it's great. I think a good cartoon one would be Voltron. Did you ever watch that That's one? Not an anime, I'm sorry. Yeah, uh, That's like saying, ooh, this is controversial. That's like saying Pokemon is an anime, which a lot of people consider Pokemon an anime. It's a cartoon. I'm sorry. Ethan, what do you say? Pokemon, anime or cartoon? He doesn't huh? understand our language. He's in another planet okay. right now. Um, I'm sorry. I don't consider Pokemon an anime. It's a cartoon. Okay. Then you may like Voltron because it's a cartoon. It is a cartoon. Yeah. That's a very good cartoon. Yeah. It is. I haven't seen it, but I've heard great things. Me and Qua watched it. Qua watched it too? Nice. Yep. I got him to watch it because I told him I was very into it. And he nice. goes, well, if you're into it, it must be halfway decent. Yeah. Because he knows I don't just watch shit. Qua. Uh, another one that was a great cartoon. Do you remember Metabots? No. I feel like if I showed you a picture, you'd remember. But um, 
It was kind of like uh, it was a weird like. Do you remember? Oh, is Digimon anime or cartoon? Cartoon. It was drawn like an anime though. So was Pokemon. Mm-mm. Yeah. Pokemon was way more three D and cartoon. No, it was not. You don't remember Pokemon well then. It was not all flat. Ring a bell at all? Click anything? No. <laughs> no. I feel like that was your time of cartoons. Um, fuck, what was that other one? I think it was like Robix or Rubix or something. Rubik. No, that's not it, is it? No, that's... I don't know. <clears throat> anyway. I want to um, revamp Cyber Chase from PBS. <sighs> You know how good a live action cyber chase would be? Oh, that'd be so fucking cool. They could a live so action good. cyber chase movie? They could, so, they could do it so well. Oh my god, that'd be so cool. <laughs> live action Arthur movie. <laughs> Ew, no. No. Do you know what do you know what a Christmas tradition I consider is? Watching Arthur's Christmas. Oh hell yeah. That is like movie. one of my number one Christmas movies. That's a good Christmas movie. That is movie. a great Christmas movie. Well, I loved Arthur growing up. That was our shit. Arthur was the shit. Like, n- and then Buster's. What was Buster's show? He I had his. Know. He had like a traveling show. You don't remember it? Buster, yeah. yeah, something like he had a traveling show. I remember he his little like logo though, with his dad who was a pilot. Yeah, yeah. Man, that was such a good show. Zabumafu. Wow. Getting to watch the Bumafu coming home from like fourth grade and eating a frozen pretzel with way too much salt on it was my like life. Yeah. We Maybe watched like Cyber Chase at grade. dinner. We always yes. watched Cyber Chase at dinner. Oh, hell yeah. We had that little shitty TV in that dining dining room. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Our Kitchen, house. dining room. Yeah. Oh, man. I miss that house the way it was set up. It was pretty sweet. Yeah. There's a. Easy I feel like layout. the living room just felt so much bigger the way it was. Our, yeah. our living room is like the hub of everything, like it's the center of everything. Mm-hmm. So there's a lot of traffic, so it doesn't feel like a nice homey. That place. one was like separated with like yeah. a nice everything was big separated open properly. With a couch, yeah. yeah. I miss that house. It was, it was a, a nice house. house. Yeah, but it's bad neighborhood. Yeah, definitely don't want heroin addicts as a neighbor. No, and heroin dealers. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. We were talking about um, like a future house we were wanting, Mm -hmm. if we were going to build one or if we were going to buy one. What would you do? Buy one. Really? You'd buy a pre-made one? Because I feel like building one would be too much stress. Because when you see building one, you see your perfect house the way you want it. And sadly, that's just not going to happen exactly. Like It's going to be close, I'm sure. But there's going to be things they have to do. To where it won't be exactly what you want. And yeah. if you can find one you can fall in love with that's already made pretty close, you won't be upset as much. That's how yeah. I see it. I was talking about wanting to build one of those giant barn loft house type things. Have you seen those on TikTok? Yes, the it's like almost like a big ass garage plan. kind of, yeah, but they have a like giant a loft open. Up yes, top. and then yes. there's like a staircase where it's like a I little like those. Lo- I, think I want one of those idea cause because I think that would be so badass to have your car as a centerpiece in your house. Like have well, the garage open underneath. I guess like the whole house is the garage. The like the room, whole everything. downstairs is like a giant living room, kitchen, dining table. Like it's all open. There's not yes. really any walls separating anything. And then upstairs you have a private room and all that. Yeah. That's what I want. If I'm gonna build a house, I'm gonna build a giant barn style house like that, with like thirty, forty foot ceilings. That's what I like the most is the giant ceilings. Yeah. It just feels so much more open. Sorry. This turn is to Trevor Googling. I'm not Googling. This turn into Trevor texting. I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. The fuck? I have a MILF as a girlfriend, so oh she's a mom, God. and she worries if I don't text her that I got home safe. I'm sorry. She's a mom. You just had to brag on that a little bit, huh? 
I wasn't bragging at all. I was just saying. I got a MILF as a girlfriend. <laughs> I don't want to say I have a mom as Subtle a girlfriend because that sounds kind of weird, but I don't know. I mean, it's true. You said, I got a MILF as I a girlfriend. I definitely wasn't flexing, but she definitely is a MILF. <laughs> I'll say flex. that. She's a slight flex. <laughs> all right. I'll flex it. She's a MILF. Slight flex. I got a MILF. Dude, your mom's a MILF. <laughs> Have you seen that video? That good Dude. neighbor video? Have you seen the TikTok where it's the kid playing Xbox and um, oh, fuck, he's playing like Call of Duty or some? What are you freaking out about? Something's. Stop that. Stop it's that. It's the cord. It's the cord. Uh, I'll put it over here. <laughs> <laughs> Pink eye when you answer the phone later. Hello. I can't come in anymore. I have poop eye. <laughs> what were we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> um. Oh, the TikTok where the kid yes. is playing Call of Duty. Yes. And um, his mom calls him from the other room, and uh, she says something to him like. Honey, I'm going out. Or what? Why are your eyes so wide? Were you freaking out? I was waiting for you to finish your sentence. Sorry. Were you slowly, gradually opening your eyes as I was? Sorry. I was tilting Um, my head back. She says something like, I'm going out. And he says, Okay, mom. She says, I'll be back in like an hour. Blah, blah, blah. blah. She's going on a date. And the guy comes in and he goes, Hey, bud. He goes, Who are you? She goes, I'm your mom's date. And he goes, Okay. And he goes, are you Kingslayer 69 or whatever? Oh, that was Caleb W. Francis's video. Was it? Yes. Well, somebody redid it in a TikTok. It was know. his video doing the... And it, his name above him was like XX Slayer 69. Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah he yeah. was like, yeah. Remember I told you I'd fuck, fuck your, your mom? mom? Yeah. Well, it I'm was Do great. it, yeah. It was great. Yeah. Love I'm pretty it. sure it was a Caleb Francis I video. I yeah. He's so fucking funny. Mm-hmm. He got a shout out on Rhett and Link. No shit? Yeah. Nice. Uh, Rhett shouted him out. Have you ever watched his streams? No. I haven't either. You know, I watch his they TikTok so talk about his streams. Like when I hit the TikTok thing of live streaming, because he's just live streaming his face to let everybody know Yeah. That he's live streaming on Twitch. Yeah. It just sounds kind of boring. He's funny, but... Yeah, he's really funny. Especially when he starts killing people. His war zone. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing. We're just- oh, I played a game of Apex today. That shit was so much. Dude, have you even tried it recently? No. No? Not recently. Not in a long time. Would you even think about it? Is it like high action, high pace? Like It can be. I don't want that. Well, then you don't. I'm over those games. I really am. It's a lot of fun. Like, even when I play Call of Duty, like, I'm just trying to kill one. Have fun. I'm not. I don't. I don't like the competition of battle royales because the way it's portrayed is like if you get taken out early, you suck. And then what's the fun in that? See, that's not how I feel in Apex because like everybody's like fucking great at Apex. So like that's terrible. So Why would I want to play something that so I'm when bad I kill, at that everybody else is great at? So when I start getting like two or three kills a game, I'm like, wow. I'm not actually as bad as I was. So it's no. it's I think Apex is so much fun cuz I'm seeing progression. Mm. I killed like 5 people in a game today by myself with a, a random solo or a random duo that I was playing with. Mm. And I popped off and it was so much fucking fun. Yeah. I don't know. No. It's a lot of fun. I just have like even regularly cuz it's way like different just, than league. Huh? It's way different than League. Well, yeah, it's obviously. Just it's so a much better. Game it's a nice change of pace again. Because yeah. we quit playing Need for Speed. I'm down to go back to playing that. I never finished. That's what everybody I said. <laughs> really? Everybody said, I'm down to go back. I'm down to go back. We've never And then they back. started placing Space Engineers space or whatever engineers, the fuck that shit is. they all commit their time to Space Engineers. What the fuck is that shit? Space Garbage. Minecraft. Garbage. It's like Engineers' like dream. So elongated. And I don't want elongated. It looks so hard. Like, it looks like way too much strategy. I don't... And not even strategy, just, like, too much thinking. And grinding and getting I materials. Hate grinding. That's why I quit playing fucking 
whatever MMO RPGs. That's just, it's too much. I don't have t- that kind of time to dedicate to. It's not that I don't like them. It's just that I can't dedicate my time. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like, TFT is just like the perfect game for me. It's like I can sit there and watch my YouTube videos while playing a game and talking to y'all, and it's like I just I'm can't. still having fun. Like I can't. I can't. I'm not into it anymore. Then why are you I always able to is. play it or wanting to play it? Or not like wanting, but like... Because it's just a game that you're, you'll are you play. Okay. I don't want to play by myself. Playing mm. by myself just isn't fun. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Don't have to be <laughs> sorry. I'm the one that plays it. <laughs> so you're sorry? No. Oh. <laughs> I don't think anybody needs to be sorry here. Okay. Fair enough. What game do we need to play? I don't fucking know, man. That was me. That was you? I couldn't tell. It felt like I had one, but... I felt uh, that one. Oh, it was a burp coming. That's what it was. I swear I felt one. I feel like we just need to find, like... That's the problem these days. There's no, like, the game anymore. That's like... we can. League is one of those, like... Yeah, everybody can play it. And yeah, we can all play together. But it's like, do we have fun every time? No. Like, somebody gets pissed off. Somebody gets angry at another person. <clears throat> James. Uh, it's just not... Somebody is always able to make it not fun for the other person. That's how every game is. Yeah. Need for Speed was great. We always had... There was no, like, major problem in Need for Speed. But it can get old fast. It's just racing. Like, there's no major difference every time. It's just mm-hmm. racing. Especially when we do the same races over and over, over again, you get over, cash just... or whatever, and then you go get to build another front car, and then you have to do the same thing all over. It's just, and then your new front car isn't fast enough, so you get back in your old regular car, and then exactly, there's no D game anymore, and that sucks. That sucks. Yeah, we need to find the game again. It's just hard to do because, like, the game has to have like a six-player team. That all five of us six. I mean, yeah, preferably six, but yeah, I mean, five is like good enough. Yeah, but like then somebody's left out if there is not like always. the six. There's sometimes there's usually always somebody not on. That's the thing. And so it's not bad to have like one random if that there's like yeah. a six squad. That's why like Call of Duty was mm-hmm. the shit for a long time because true, we could all play yeah. and nobody ever had to feel left out and we could all just get on and fucking play. Yeah, no matter what. That's true. I feel like that's the problem with games these days. They're all like, oh, we can play them for a month or two and then we get bored. Mm-hmm. That shouldn't... A game needs to be like... You need to be able to play it and replay it and replay it and continue to have fun different times every time. They're just fucking milking us for our money at this point. Basically, man. It's bullshit. Bullshit. It's bullshit. I wish they had like an MMO... I want to get back into RPG VR. like Pokemon. Like, everybody could get together and just go around and have fun collecting these monsters or whatever. I feel like that's a it's good, like Pokemon simple... Go. But Pokemon... It was just I too guess. much. It was just too much. It was a lot. You couldn't casually play. If you were going to yeah, play, you, you were out. get into it. Yeah. yeah. That's the great thing about the Nintendo Game Boy and 3DS Pokemons is you could play them at your leisure and still have fun. But you couldn't play with friends. You could only battle your friends. Who texted you? Yeah, it said it's always going to be it's always going to be league for you and me. That is the game for us. There is nothing else. James knows that feeling. So does Qua. Like how I fed the shit out of you today. That feeling of absolute carry mode is like nothing else. And he's right. Like I got super fed on Yone, Mm -hmm. and we were just having a blast. Like it was just super fun and exactly. It's just league, but that was just the two of y'all, right? Yeah, just playing today. So, neither one of y'all got mad. You just had fun. That's the problem. That doesn't always happen. Yeah. that's the, It doesn't always happen with League. If it always happened with League, there's oh my no God. game. There's no It'd game be the best that game that's ever, always going to happen, though. You never know. You, you do know. We have to accept that we can't win everything. Yeah. But nobody can accept that. I mean, I have accepted it. No, you haven't. Because you still get angry. Not as much. If as you did accepted to. it, right I don't now, get you angry. wouldn't get angry at all playing. I the game. don't get You'd be like, all right, guys, that was a good game anyway. You've never said that once. If you've 
had a bad game. If I'm playing like shit, I'm like, wow, this just isn't fun because I'm playing like shit. I'm not mad that I'm but not you winning. Have fun. That's the problem. It's just because I know game, I'm even playing if you like lose, shit. I know, but even if you lose, there needs to be a way you still had fun. That's the main thing. Like That's especially how I in feel Earth, in Apex. Earth is supposed to be like this super crazy fun game. No. And if you lose hard at Earth, you're like, fuck this stupid game. Yeah. You shouldn't feel like that about a game. That's the main problem. That's how I feel about Apex right now. When I lose, I'm not like, oh, fuck. I'm like, like, oh, I'll just go to But can you say you still had fun even though you lost? Yeah, because okay. I feel like I'm learning still. Like my movement oh, okay. is getting that's, way better in my aiming. That's different, and, but yeah. I can see but that. that's the fun to me is learning that game right now. I'm just having a blast playing it. I think that's why we all enjoyed Call of Duty so much is that even once we learned it, there was many things to unlock and to do. But once you cap out, you cap out. Yeah. Once you cap out, you cap out. But that's why I liked Warzone because it was kind of like rebuilding your whole Call of Duty loot out. Loot out? Loot out. Load out every time. But then the crates when you would just grab your load out with your pre-made guns and you would wreck shit because you know how to use it. It just came less and less fun. And now there's a war zone meta and everything like that. And if you don't play with the meta with the right guns, then you're not going to be as good as everybody else. Meta ruins games too. That's so. why I like Apex. I feel like there's not a meta. Really? Every game has a different set of champions because champions are the people that won the last game. Mm-hmm. Like every, I've never seen like the exact same combo every single game for many games in a row. It's hmm. always different champions that's that are cool. the winners because it's like. I also feel like Overwatch is a little bit like that. That's what Logan said. Oh, Logan, so we need to get back into Overwatch because like it's Overwatch just fun. Like, He's yeah. like, it's not super competitive when you don't play comp. He's like, it's just. He goes, and you realize how bad you are. He goes, it's just people are really good at that game. Yeah. He goes. He goes. Do you play with Ethan? And I was like, yeah. And he goes, that's why you feel like you suck. He goes, Ethan's way too high ranked and good. Makes sense. I was like, yeah, he is. I feel like I could get back into Overwatch for sure. I, I like feel like Overwatch. it's an easy playable game, but at the same time, you could still have some crazy fucking cool moments that make you hype up the game, but there's also like, you don't feel that bad for losing. Yeah, Claude just never bought Overwatch again because he had it on his Xbox and didn't want to buy it for that PC again. That wouldn't be a to buy Overwatch for PC. That we have another game we can all move over to. Have you tried the mint one in Breeze? <gasps> no. You didn't know he had a mint one? Is this what you're telling me about? Okay, he tried saying they had a Calimax one, but it wasn't Calimax. I think he was trying to explain the Breeze. Oh. Yeah, that's the one he has at the beer store. What are we at? A good 5 7 farther? Hour 6? A little low. A little less. Hour 2. Hour four. All right, whatever. What is that one? He's priming it for you. The fuck is Max that? Max flow hype. What the fuck is that if shit? You can adjust the airflow. Oh no! Don't want that. Yeah, you can adjust the airflow on it. I don't need that. Mighty mint puff. Mighty mint. Or it's hype. Hype. Mm. Little, mm. Doll. little doll little doll good catch <sighs> this is a good episode i yeah, feel like it was a good talk we didn't need anything else we just talked for an hour straight yeah literally good. yeah that's how they should be that's how they should be so We're, that's how they should be it's okay to take a week off Yes, it's okay to take a little time off, but I still want to have an it episode ed- out. It ends up, I know, but it ends up making another good episode. I know. If we take a week off, we have plenty more to talk about. That too. Like, I can understand if they're super stale and we just want to upload a whatever. Yeah. That's, I think we made the compromise that we should have came up with what a if long we time did, ago. What if we did? Like stacked fi- guest. Well, yeah. What? Filler guest filler episodes like that's exactly what I was thinking. we guests. have like hannah lauren and kelsey record an episode for us and whenever we don't oh no have time for an episode we record up we we put up their episode i meant like we have like a guest on and we just oh. do like a random fucking we could do that show too. i think it'd be great if we had like um a hannah and andy episode in the books or we had hannah lauren and kelsey episode in the books or even an ethan and i don't know fucking anybody just an episode in the books to post whenever we don't have time to do it. You know what yeah. I mean? That's what most of the major people do. 
Yeah. They just have people on the side. No offense. like Not like on the side, but just... I feel like that's bad because y'all aren't our side bitches. Like, it's just... Um, it's like when Tom got hospitalized. Tom Segura. Oh. He, like, broke his arm. Remember I showed you the clip of him falling on his arm and all that shit? He, they had, oh, like... Basketball. They had, like, episodes stacked up. So he and, could recover. Yeah, so they had, like, recovery. And then he went on beyond their stacked episodes that they had, like, random guests fill in for him. Even. Yeah. So... I think that's good. That's why I was like, why don't you and Ethan do it? That'd be great. But He didn't want to sit in. I offered. I even asked Dad. I said, Dad, would you want to sit in? He goes, sure. And then time came and he goes, uh. I was uh, like, well, we're recording. It's like, okay. I tried. Yeah. I tried. It's not what do you call it without Trevor, though. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I think it's okay to have other... Bam! Bam. All right, dude. Chill. Finisher. Finisher. End it out. I think it's okay to not have both of us at the same time every time. I agree. Like, even if you want to take a day off, it's okay. You don't have to be on every episode, Joseph. I don't don't think you've accepted that yet. I have. I could. Sure? I could do more. What? I love podcasting. I love talking. Well, yeah, I know. So I could do more podcasts. Like I could. I, I know. Me and Andy talk about starting one. That's great. We're gonna call it spare pair of pants. Spare pair of pants. We're gonna give life tips about like dating or like any situation, and like one of the main main tips is always have a spare pair of pants in your car. Like always have a backup bitch. No, oh. always have a spare pair of pants with you in case you spill oh. something or. You right. need to change clothes or okay. always have a spare pair of pants. Oh. Always have a backup. Always have this if you're in this situation. Right. That's what we talked about doing. Because right. she said she couldn't do this. Just talk? Just talk, yeah. Why not? Like, just talk, yeah, but like my brain works on more organization. So she needs like a topic she list for us to follow. Yeah. Mm, fair enough. So we're going to call it spare pair of pants. Spare pair of pants. Check that out coming soon. Maybe. Coming soon, we maybe. don't know. Don't know. Because she doesn't want me to pay for another uh, domain. Right. And I don't know if I want to post it under what do you call it mm. as a like side project or. Yeah. It's the, the what do you call a side bitch? Yeah. Spare pair of pants. Spare pair of pants. It's the spare pair of pants. So what do you call Whoa! it? Whoa! The backup plan <sighs> for what do you call it? Spare pair of pants. Spare. I think we just set that in concrete. <laughs> Boom. Done. <laughs> That's what happens when I'm not here. Spare pair of pants. Was that Valentine's Day? No. We came with that a long time ago. What? It was when I spilled coffee on me. You smoked coffee? Spilt. Oh. I need to get my hearing checked. Yeah. You get your I want to do that thing where they pull out all the shit of your ear. I was watching those I don't want to watch it, night. but I just want to do it. I was it watching so those videos last night on Hannah's couch. I really? was watching those videos next to you as we were sleeping. It's what I watched to fall asleep. Oddly. That's, yeah, I was just odd. watching it at the table with her because um, I saw something on Instagram of it and then I started looking them up on YouTube and then I was falling asleep to the videos. What was Thank you so much for listening. Thank you, everyone, We're for back. listening for episode 70 of What Do You Call It? <laughs> Just as a pet. He can do it. What do you call it without me? He's offended as fuck. He's so mad. His eyes are closed. Now they're open. And he's shaking his head now because he's so eyes. Nice. Open eyes. <laughs> Close eyes. Dynamic band. <laughs> we love. Uh, you know what that's from? E.T. E.T. Yeah. yeah. Boom. Look at you go. I want to re-listen to Dynamic Banter. I think that'll get me back into the like, drive of podcast maybe. But I don't have time. When am I just going to sit and listen? I don't drive anymore, so I don't have time to like just sit and listen to a podcast. At the counter. 
I, I, f- I feel bad. Like if I have or a headphone in and there's a customer. Somebody walks up, pull it out. True. How many times? Not today, obviously, but like. Yeah, fuck. Yeah. yeah. I see what you mean. I should. I need, I need, I need to. It helps. Helps me. When I'm like out just doing shit and somebody walks up, I either turn it all the way down or I just pull it out. Right. All right, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.